Hey, Ram Nation, good Wednesday evening along with Rodney Ashby from Rams Unlimited. I'm Robbie Robinson, and this is a Roots Chris Steakhouse What's at Stake. George Mason comes a call into the Siegel Center to take on the VCU Rams. And Rodney, we know all about George Mason, our friend from Fairfax, Virginia. But what is at stake for Mike Rhodes and his squad here tonight? Well, I'll tell you what, it's a big one, right? Similar to those sizzling plates at Ruth Chris, VCU coming in in one of the hottest teams in America right now. An opportunity to continue to lead the A-10, wanting 10 out of 11 after a big crosstown rival win against University of Richmond. All right, you said 10 out of 11. Yes, also five in a row in the league. VCU is at six and one in the A-10. What does that mean for VCU to be atop the standings in such a conference like the Atlantic 10 as we're down in January and getting ready to February? You know, we're thinking A-10 is going to be somewhere between one and two bids right now. You're fighting for a potential at-large bid if things don't go our way in the tournament. And what you have to do right now is increase your net ranking, and every win does that. All right, so George Mason comes in, very talented squad. They've got this guy, Josh Aduro, very good. Tell me a little bit about him. What can Ram fans beware of with Aduro, and what does he bring to the game? Look, he's a kid with high motor, very talented, plays with his both face to the basket and back to the basket, which makes him very difficult to guard. I love this matchup between him and Brandon Johns. It's going to be so fun to watch. I'm excited to see those two go. But you can't double team him when he plays with his back to the basket. They've got two guards that like to shoot the rock. One of them has shot over 145 threes so far this year, averaging about 35% makes. The other one, only 93s, but averaged 45% makes. So it's not like you have to be very strategic when you double down off of those guys. All right, Rodney, what's the advantage for VCU then? Well, I think our advantage is continue our pressure. We're doing such a great job in our full court pressure when we're only limiting teams, even when we don't get steals. We're limited teams to only play half court defense on for us to play half court defense for 15 to 20 seconds. That's a huge advantage for VCU, especially the way that we play defense. All right, he's Rodney Ashby. I'm Robbie Robinson. A big one tonight here at the Siegel Center as George Mason and VCU do battle at the Stew. Hope everybody enjoys the game. This has been a Roots Chris Steakhouse. What's at stake?